don't want to touch it. I love it so much. Tell story. What are you doing, Fev? Are you sitting like Tell a human? Mahi? No. Who's that? Who's that? Oh, the mermaid. Tap the screen yeah. and press the little arrow phone button. <laughs> 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 so we bought a nativity scene two or three years ago it was i think it was towards the end of christmas or something and so we just put it in a box because we knew that we were moving and then when we moved into this house it got like lost in a box and we forgot that we had it and this year we found it and so i'm really excited to pull i don't even remember what it looks like joe wants to put it here but i don't know about that this is kind of like christmas oh, i'm gonna get styrofoam everywhere that's never fun to clean up i think it would look pretty on this table now that i see what it looks like I love it so much. Oh, Joe should be here with me. Now I feel guilty. Maybe I'll just have it set up for him as a surprise so I don't feel guilty. There we go. Oh, and it has, it has little stuff here. Okay, so that's one piece. This is like my favorite part right here, although I've just opened it. But look. Oh, it fits inside of his hand. Look. Sorry, I'm trying to have it focus on it. I'll do close-ups. Oh, it's the baby Jesus. Oh, I love every piece. And she has a little bunny next to her. How perfect is that? Okay, so that was box one. We still have three to go. Here's a little deer. How perfect is that? It's pretty perfect. Is it focusing on my face or is it focusing on the deer? A precious little lamb. No. And then the donkey. It took us so long to get a nativity scene because I saw so many of them and none of them were like my style. And so I remember when I saw this and I was just like, that's the nativity scene. Cause before that I had been looking for like six or seven years and just none of the nativity scenes spoke to me and I felt like all the ones that I was finding like looked like everybody else's nativity scene. But this is the donkey. And I like that he has some red on him, brings in some fun color and he's standing on some leaves. Box three. I'm guessing this one is the like little barn. Is I right? Yay, I was right. So it's like little sparkly branches. And then it has a star hanging right here. Good choice, Joe and Brittany from three years ago. Okay, last box. What am I missing? When Harper gets older, we're definitely gonna have to buy her like a toy nativity scene that like she's allowed to play with. It's the three wise men. And then he has a little squirrel next to him. Is that gonna focus on that? And then we have another wise men. And the last one, I really like his um, robe. Anybody else have that? Because it looks like music notes. Love that. Okay, that is the nativity scene. Aww, that's super cute. You know what it reminds me of? The, um, that love thing right here. I'm glad you took my advice. Yeah, it looks real good here, right here, huh? It's weird because this year, now that I'm a mother and I kind of understand a little bit of, oh, don't cry, <laughs> a little bit of that mother's love, I feel like I look at the whole nativity story a little bit different. Even just seeing Mary and Joseph in these little figurines and seeing them, the way that they are looking at Jesus Christ and just the love and admiration and how much they adore him even though they're just little figurines you can you can see it and you can feel it i'm seeing even more now just how sacred 
that night was and one of my favorite Christmas songs is Breath of Heaven and it talks about um, Mary and just her prayer that night just putting yourself a tiny bit in her shoes and just just realizing everything that she was going through the hardship and the emotions and kind of just seeing the whole nativity story through different eyes and just growing an even stronger testimony of it. Hey.